Isabel met an enormous bear. Isabel, Isabel didn't care. The bear was hungry. The bear was ravenous. The bear's big mouth was cruel and cavernous. The bear said, Isabel, glad to meet you. I'll do it, okay? Now, I'll eat you. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She washed her hands and she straightened her hair up. Then Isabel quietly ate the bear up. Once in a night, as black as pitch, Isabel met a wicked old witch. The witch's face was cross and wrinkled, the witch's dumbs with teeth were sprinkled. Ho, ho, Isabel, the old witch crowed. I'll turn you into an ugly toad. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She showed no rage and she showed no rancor, but she turned the witch into milk and drink. Isabel met a hideous giant. Isabel continued self-reliant. The giant was hairy, the giant was hovered. The giant had one eye in the middle of his forehead. Hello, Isabel, the giant said. I'll grind your bones to make my bread. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She nibbled the zooey back that she always fed off. And when it was gone, she cut the giant's head off. Isabel met a troublesome doctor. He punched and he poked till he really shocked her. The doctor's talk was of coughs and chills, and the doctor's satchel bulged with pills. The doctor said, Take this, it will make you well. Isabel, Isabel didn't worry. Isabel didn't scream or scurry. She took the pills from the pill concoctor, and Isabel calmly cured the doctor. <laughs>